in terms of one two train simulator 12 um this seems like a simulator that tried to keep up with the kids you know like with the the the, the z on the end of the the z on the end of the name um Wow, that was a terrible joke. I do apologize. Hello, Internet, and welcome to Train Simulator 2, even, not 12. I got that wrong. Um, yes. I played Train Simulator 2014 about eight months ago, and I was good at that, so I figured, let's have a go at this as well, because this is different. Um, I, d I don't know if it's any good. Um, I don't know if I'll be able to, you know, kind of get anywhere with it. But already, at the beginning, create your dream railroad in hand of your uh, the hand of your palm, d download now in the App Store. Mm, no, I won't do that. Thank you. Select route. Oh my god, what is that banging? Turned out. Oh god. What is all this? Jesus Christ. Okay. We'll do... I don't know which... That one. That one looks nice. Yes. View sessions. Drive session. Sure. What the hell's happening with my mouse? The hell's happening with my mouse? Stop happening with my mouse. My, my, why is my mouse so big? Why is the resolution so wrong? Why is everything so wrong? Oh my god. Uh, not very good first impressions. Oh, finally. Okay. Soon happened. Um, right. Uh, okay. What is this? Can you move this around? Oh, you can. That's why it's in the corner. Right. Okay. Oh, what's this? Autopilot command. Bells. Z again. Call at. Um, no, I want to do call at and bells. That seems awesome. Uh... I don't know what I don't know what all this is. What is all this? Jesus Christ! There's so much, many things. There are so many things. Horns again with the Z. Um, the hell is this? I'm sorry, but this isn't good. This isn't as good as. Oh my God! Uncouples. Why? Why with the Z? Available drivers. Let's take. Um, is is the one called Tom? So that would be really useful. No? Oh, yes, there is. He looks like a... Wow, what the hell does he do? He looks weird. <laughs> is there one called Cube? I'm guessing there isn't. No, there isn't, is there? Uh, it's frozen again. Why does it keep on freezing? Is it V-Sync? I'm guessing it is V-Sync. I don't like V-Sync. Can we turn that off? I don't know. I guess we'll see. Ooh, what's this? We'll pick that one. Oh, hello. What the hell is this? I just want to... I just want to drive! I don't care. Just let me drive. Let me drive. Yes. Good. Don't show this tip again. Next. Can we please drive now? Why is all this? Why is this so... Hang on. Options. Video settings. Uh. Um. Uh. Where's... Gen general settings. No? Uh. Surveyor settings. What's this? Uh. What is all this? Where's where's VSync? Why is VSync not a thing here? When was this game made? Gamma minimum. I don't know if that has anything to do with it, but apparently, well, I don't know if it does or not. Let's just press take and please. Oh no, gamma looks horrible now. <laughs> let me please just become part of a train, please, please let me become part of a train. I want to pick Tom. Oh, there we go. Uh, move to train. There. No. Run around train. Run around. No. Okay, that doesn't work. Bells. I can't. He oh, local hook. Hang on. Is this multiplayer? Is it, is that me? Local is it local host me? What? Just let me become part of a train, please. I j all I want to do. Why is this not focusing properly on me? No, that way then. Why is that not inverted? Oh my god. What are all of these words? Why is it so laggy? Why many questions? I don't, I don't get this. Why is it so laggy? The FPS isn't dropping. Why is this so laggy? Oh my god, now the FPS is at like 1. Stop being so rubbish! Oh my god, this is not as good as Train Simulator. What have I bought? Oh my god. Loads of people said that this was like... Gr oh my god, what the hell? Wow. Okay, road. There must be an easy way of doing this. Surely there must have been an easy, easy way of doing this. Start there. No, start there. Oh, we can change that apparently. That's not useful at all. Oh, there we go. That's how it works. Why is it like 15 frames per second? 
I'm not in a train. I just seem to be in like God's train or something. I seem to be flying. This isn't normal, is it? <laughs> this. Ah. Uh... Okay. Apparently, I'm meant to be pre pretend to be on a train. What's this? Oh no, never mind. I thought it was gonna be a thing, but apparently not. Start there. Yes. Can I start now? Move. Run around train. I don't want to run around a train. Move to train. There. No? Okay. Tom, help me. Mr. Weird Man, help me. Please help me. Oh my god. Right, it's time to play the non. Am I player non? Apparently not. Apparently I'm not playing non. That's annoying. Uh. I don't know where my train is. Shall we learn how to do something? Hang on. Exit game or exit driver? Exit driver. Don't save. No. Select route. Back to main menu. There we go. Learn to drive. Can I please learn how to drive? Play tutorial. I'm gonna see. I'm still not in a train. <laughs> After all this time, I'm still like, hello and welcome to Train Simulator Tutorials. These tutorials are designed to give you the knowledge you'll need to play. Try enjoy. Enjoy is never a word in my vocabulary when it comes to simulators. You'll need to enjoy. Oh God. In this tutorial, learn how to uh, how to the. In this tutorial, learn how the train's menu bar, the camera controls, and how to use the map. I want to know how to drive a train. That's all I want. That's what a simulator is used for. Oh, okay. Let me get in a train. Please let me get into a train. I don't care about this camera crap. I want to no. Uh. Okay, thank you. I want to get into a train. Let me get in this train. That's all I want is to get into this train right here. Oh, hold. Hold control plus. Right click. Oh my god, it's frozen. Oh, for God's sake. <laughs> what is it with... Oh, God. What is it with simulators and them, like, exploding? It crashed again. <laughs> for God's sake. Colin McRae was as bad as this. I'm sorry, but I didn't enjoy that at all. Shall I play a different game? Let's play a different game. Let's play a good game, shall we? Let's 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 play what what game should we play? Um Should we do a uh I really want to play a good game. Let's play Euro Truck Simulator, yes. Not Far Cry 2, no, I want Euro Truck Simulator, yes, there we go. A surprise let's play. Yay. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Let's do a surprise let's play and then let's rant about simulators. The thing is though, is that simulators are they're usually terrible. Which is the thing. Simulators are usually terrible, but then train simulator comes along. Train simulator, you know, oh do you want to allow auto a check in? No. Disable. Thank you. Continue game. Um Oh yeah, by the way, I started a brand new uh, game because, you know, stuff it. <laughs> um, which is why I have a terrible, terrible profile, just to let you know. Um, right, let's do a job. Um, so I can rant about simulators and how terrible things are. I want to do a long one, please. Uh, wow, that sounds rude, isn't it? <laughs> I'm sorry. If you've got a bad mind, you know what I mean. Right. How long is this? Um, I don't know. Ah, oh, stuff it. Let's just take the job. It's, well, is that longer than this one? Wow. Uh, <laughs> no, let's do that one. Stop it. We'll take this job here. Um, yeah, basically, the thing is... Is that simulators are usually terrible. Oil rig simulator. I've never played it. I'm guessing it is ter terrible. Oh, press up through to get rid of that. There we go. Um, I really want to sleep. Because otherwise it's just going to be like this all the time. I don't really want that. Lights on. There we go. Um, yeah, but then when you start to get to like Train Simulator, the one where everybody's like, you know, the, the simulator that we've not just uh, that we've just played, not Train Simulator 2014. Tra Train Simulator 2014 is probably one of the best simulators out there, including this game. Um, oh, that was close. Jesus Christ! Wait there, train. Not train. Why are you? You're a lorry, aren't you? Sorry. Um, 
But yeah, basically, I mean, you get simulators that try to be very, very good, i.e. Train Simulator, which is what we've just played. And, uh, what else? Uh, uh, what's that? M Microsoft Flight Simulator. They're both going to be good simulators if they just get it correct. But they never, never do. But then you get simulators that come along, like Euro Truck Simulator, that come along and go, no, I'll try to be good. And it ends up being absolutely insanely amazing. I mean, honestly, if you check on my Steam profile, I think it's like something like 200 odd hours or 100 odd hours on this game. Just this game alone. Uh, to say I've played 200 odd hours of Ace of Spades, I mean, that just kind of proves that this game's good. Um, I can't be bothered to have high beams. Sorry, you can't really see anything, can you? Uh, <laughs> right, anyway, yeah, so this is going to be a bit of a rant video, I know, but oh well. Um... And yeah, I don't know, it just really, really frustrates me when games just kind of get onto Steam and it's like, they're not real games. Oh, by the way, I've marked my indicators, just to let you know. Uh, I'm, I'm a real nerd when it comes to this game. I love this game to pieces. Uh, by the way, if it lags, it's because I haven't any chance to really turn down the options. Um, where have my lights gone? <laughs> where have my lights? Lights don't work like that. Um, but yeah, no, I just, I just find it so frustrating, really. To be honest with you, simulators don't generally, I don't know, they never really do very well. Unless they're this, or Train Simulator 2014, which is another fantastic thing, as I've already said. Uh, yeah. Another little rant thing as well is that um, Steam is letting games on onto Steam that just shouldn't be there. You know, Steam make, um, I think Steam, well, I believe Steam make a little bit of cash out of um, I have new Apple, apparently. Let's have a look at the mail. Oh, is it the... Yeah, it's the bank. Okay. Um, but yeah, there's there's games on Steam that just shouldn't make it onto Steam. I... Uh, um, what's it? Air Control, is it? Air, uh, Air, I think it's called Air Control. Air Control and Colin McRae Rally. That game that I've played... I say game. It's a shit game, anyway. Um, the game that I played a, f a couple of days ago. Um, they just shouldn't be making it onto Steam. And when, when games like that do make it onto Steam, people are given a false sense of the game in the, you know, the uh, the preview things and, like, you know, the description and stuff like that. They, they go on and buy the game. Um, and then people start complaining because it's terrible, which they do generally end up being. Uh, and I think the thing is, is Steam gets a lump sum of cash for every game that they sell. Which they do. I'm guessing they do. I'm, you know, I'm presuming they do. Uh, it would make sense if they do. Which means that at the moment, Steam are wanting cash, but Valve are never really wanting cash. They never turned around and said, "Well, we'll just, you know, like all, all of the games seem absolutely spot on." Portal, one of the most polished video uh, video games I've ever played in my entire life. Um, possibly one of the greatest games I've played in, you know, in ages. Um, Portal 2 came along, you know, that, that was alright, it was pretty much the same, just about 10 hours longer. But, uh... But no, Valve don't seem like the kind of game developing company that just want cash. And really don't want to, you know... They, they seem like they don't want to screw over the customers. But when it comes to Steam... They don't really mind... So much anymore. Which is depressing. Uh... I don't know, that's my opinion. I, it may be invalid, but hey-ho. Uh, this video may end up being longer than I thought it was going to be. Um, <laughs> this trade is a simulator gal galore. Trade it, yeah. Right, um, I'm going to stop at the next services, actually, just to um, have a bit of a sleep. Otherwise, you're going to be staring at a black screen for the next 20 minutes, which is not something that anyone really wants to do, is it? I think we have uh, just enough time, don't we? 24 hours. Yeah, it should be fine. Please let me sleep. Oh, please let me sleep. Oh, for God's sake, it's not going to let me sleep. <laughs> it's not going to let me sleep, is it? I just want to sleep. So all I want to do is just let me sleep. That's really all I care about at the moment. There. Ah, oh, there we go. J. There we go, that works. Um, yeah, what was I saying? Oh, yeah, games. Uh, I don't know. I, I I don't want to go on a rant again, but... Um, I don't know. Just games don't seem to be 
being produced anymore that kind of you know just games don't really seem to be produced anymore that I'm looking forward to either this isn't I don't know I'm I'm going a bit whoa I'm getting a bit f oh god um, no, okay. <laughs> sorry I just had a mini heart attack Wait, where are the hell are my legs gone hmm weird uh, hello Land Rover um no but uh, I don't know I'm, I'm getting a bit sick of the gaming community at the moment not the gaming community that's the wrong term but um gaming developers and the gaming world in a way uh, I don't know it's just like there's a side of Steam where Steam just want cash and don't really care about the customers which I've already talked about then you've also then got the side of game developers wanting cash I know that's you know Valve or Steam and Valve are uh, game developers but I mean there are game developers that basically just make games just to make cash which is frustrating and quite a lot of game developers seem to be heading over to where EA, uh, you know, went a few, you know, a few years ago. Um, EA basically now make terrible multiplayer games which rely on the EA servers, even if you're playing on single player. Which I found frustrating, meaning that I don't end up, you know, usually playing so many, um, so many EA games anymore. You know, that's, you know, I think the only one that I play is um, SimCity. And that seems to be okay because they've actually said that you can play that online now, which is absolutely fine. Um, but now there are games like, well, game developing companies like Ubisoft. My one of my favourite game developers, you know, game game developing companies in the world, um, and now basically heading over that way as well with the new game, The Crew. Uh, they said at EA, the, uh, not EA, sorry, E3, that um, The Crew was going to have to be played on Ubisoft servers, meaning that when the servers get shut down, you can no longer play the game. I was incredibly incredibly looking forward to playing the crew until I heard that and thought, no, stuff it, can't be asked for that. Just because it's just so much hassle and waiting for the game to come out offline just will probably never happen. You know, it's, it's not really probability, it's um, more of a possibility more than anything. Uh, I, I don't know, it's just that frustrated me when Ubisoft turned around and said, well, no, our games are now going to be like EA's. So, like, well, alright, fair enough. Um, I don't know. And then, when they then, you know, go go around and then, you know, announce a new Ubi uh, Ubisoft, uh, Far Cry 4, then I start to get really, really excited about that. And then there's, like, all this controversy about multiplayer and stuff like that, and it's like, oh, God's sake. I really want old game developers to come back. You know, the old Ubisoft. Um... I can't really think of any. Uh, any uh, Rockstar seems to be doing quite well, but they do seem to be sticking with GTA Online at the moment, which is quite frustrating. Um, but yeah, I don't know. I'm just frustrated with game developing companies believing that they can get away with murder at the moment, uh, which is really, really frustrating. Hello, Laurie. <laughs> uh, but yeah, um, yeah. Also, by the way, if you're watching this, which you probably are, soon as you can listen to me right now. Um, if you uh, for my 200 subscribers special, I'm thinking about doing a road trip video. You know, I, I know, fair enough, yeah, no Q did it. Oh, you copied no cute. But, um, I'm, I'm, I'm thinking about doing the same thing. I'm, I'm, I'm thinking about spending, a, a, you know, an hour and a half playing this game and only this game and just talking to you like I have been doing for the past five, ten minutes. That car's not going to stop. For God's sake. Hi, just, 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 just let me through, will you? I know, I know, that was a cross vehicle offence. All right, Laurie. Do you not know the rules of the road? Says he who just then turned around. It. For God's sake, car! Can you not see me? Jesus Christ! There's some blind things out there. Uh, sorry, that's very offensive. I don't mean that. I meant that car. Anyway, um, but yeah, I don't know. I'm, oh, hello. Um, I'm not really looking forward to any AAA game at the moment. Um, there's a few coming out. There's, uh, I'm speeding, but I don't care. Um, <laughs> there's there's a few AAA games coming out at the moment. Uh, there's Assassin's Creed Unity that apparently was, you know, that that was like, yeah, yay. Um, and I would be looking forward to that if it wasn't for the fact that, you know, Assassin's Creed Black Flag came out a few months ago. Just games seem to be being released just every two seconds now, rather than every couple of years. So you don't really get any chance to really look forward to games anymore. You know, 
I used to spend literally a couple of years waiting for a game, which I mean, usually people dislike. Usually people hate that because you know people don't really want to be spending a year waiting for a game. But I was like for Far Cry Three. I mean, I played Far Cry Two, um, and that was probably you know a gr the greatest game at that point that I'd ever played. Um, oh, it's night time again. Damn it. Uh, but yeah, and now. Ubisoft are turning around and going, oh, here are all these games. And uh, it's not, it's not don't, don't get me wrong, it isn't just Ubisoft. It's almost every single game developing company that... I know and I know what they're trying to do. I know The problem is, is every single game, AAA game developing company, what the hell is that? What the hell? Oh, it's a wind turbine. That is not the correct shadow. Oh, no, it is. Okay, fair enough. Um, but, yeah, game development companies have... Uh, they branched out too much. That's what they've done. So, Ubisoft now have, like, Ubisoft Montreal, Ubisoft England. You know, it's, it, Ubisoft basically everywhere at the moment. Um, so, you get... look. You know, you look forward to one game that they're, that they're releasing. Then, the next second, another Ubisoft company is saying, we're going to release, you know, a few more this month just to make people happy. And you just don't really get any chance to kind of get excited about it anymore, which is annoying. That's another part. I do apologise about this video being quite ranty, but I mean, it started off in a crap simulator. So what can you, you know, what can I say? You all expected it anyway. Um, yeah, I don't know. Game developing companies just seem to be kind of screwing everybody over at the moment. It's kind of peeing me off a bit. Uh. Mm, I'm glad I got that rant out. That, that was quite enjoyable. I quite like rant videos. Do you? <laughs> if you want more rant videos, just tell me and I'll try to find something to rant about every week. Uh, <laughs> by the way, if I'm incorrect about anything, just don't put it in the comments. I like I like to be correct. So just don't just don't tell anyone that I've got anything incorrect. Will you? Thank you. Uh, <laughs> uh, anyway, I don't know what to talk about now for the next few few minutes. Since it's going to take us about another ten minutes to finish this video. This video has almost been an hour. Oh no, it hasn't. It's been about half an hour. Oh, hello, car. Sorry, I was looking at the clock. I was kind of veering over. I need to be in this. I'm in the incorrect lane. I kind of don't know how to drive a car, which is quite worrying. Uh, I don't know. I, th I think I'm doing the things incorrectly, like, but, um, oh well. But yeah, uh, basically, from this, would you like to see a long one and a half hours Euro Truck Simulator video? Oh no. Yeah, that was alright, though, actually. That was quite a good turn. Um, shall I do a road trip video, just like NoQ did for his um, subscriber special once? Um, I don't want to see something completely different because I've got quite a few things lined up, and I'm not going to be telling anybody at all what they are because I want them all to be quite a big surprise. Um, but yeah, I don't know. Would would, would you like a road trip video? Hmm. Uh. Right, this is taking longer than I expected to finish with you. Um, a lot longer than I expected. I really, I, I really thought that. Uh, well, I mean, to be honest, though, I didn't really expect to be recording a Euro Truck Simulator video as soon as I got into Train Simulator, but it happened. Um, I, I love doing this actually. I, recording my voice with Audacity really, really helps because you know a game can crash, but I can just jump into a different game. Uh, so yeah, it feels a bit like a roller coaster, actually, isn't it? This road. Van, do not over. Take me. Ah, god damn it! I'm gonna overtake him now just to really humiliate him. Go on, I can get him. I can get him. Go on. Oh my god, did that plane just land? Was that a plane or am I seeing stuff? That's weird. Okay. Okay. Right. Yeah. So another. T oh, god, this this is taking a lot longer than I expected. Really. Quite boring, more than anything. <laughs> Talking about absolutely nothing. What else should I talk about? What else should I rant about? Uh, what else is frustrating me at the moment in the gaming world? Nothing really. Nothing much else is happening, to be honest. But you know, apart from the big hoo-ha about um, you know, like multiplayer. <laughs> Basically, it's just multiplayer. Get rid of it. Just Cause Two did multiplayer absolutely fantastically. Like absolutely great. The gaming. Uh, who are Square Enix? They made the game and then left multiplayer up to the community to make a mod for it. 
and um, which was really really fascinating, you know, because it basically if you don't make multiplayer, it gives you more chance to focus on the single player, which is you know what people buy games for. Uh, so why not let the community make the multiplayer mod? It, it kind of makes sense. I mean, the just cost two multiplayer mod is the best multiplayer out there. If if you're looking for a multiplayer, buy just cost two and download the mod. Because I tell you what, it is absolutely insane. Also, it's just like a different launcher on um, Steam as well. You can just get it off Steam, which is really nice. Uh, right, I need to get into the list lane here. Basically, to overtake everybody. Slow down. There we go. Um, what was I saying? Was, was I saying anything? Oh yeah, just got to do multiplayer. Yeah, that's really the only... Oh, I'm speeding again, damn it. That's really the only multiplayer that I enjoy playing, to be honest with you. I don't usually end up enjoying... Sorry, car, I'm coming out in front of you. Um, <laughs> God, my turning's not very good, is it? Turning circles are really hard in this game. Um, I don't generally enjoy multiplayer on games, to be really honest with you. I think they're quite dull and quite boring. Quite griefy as well. Apart from, of course, Ace of Spades Battle. Though. But, anyway. Uh, yeah, I don't, I don't generally like multiplayer games. MMOs are just terrible. Subs you know, uh, subscription-based crap that usually never really works properly. Um, yeah, that's, that's basically it. Hello, Car. I thought you were going to fly in front of me, but you didn't, because you were good. Uh, well, well, that was an expected journey, and uh, uh, <laughs> I honestly didn't expect to be doing a U trip similar to this uh, video today, but uh, apparently I did. Right, let's quickly come in here, quickly turn, 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 turn. There we go. Boop. There we go. Done. There we go. Awesome. Well, I will end it here then. Uh, so thank you for watching, everyone. Thank you for listening to me rant about nothing for the past half an hour. And uh, I'll see you guys in a little bit. Bye-bye.